Are you keeping it for tough, soldier? Make it happen. Fuck the hell. That's what I like to hear. Make sure you sign up for the Royal Navy today. Built for tough. You're breaking my immersion. Fuck your immersion. You got to make it for tough. It looks good and all, but the top looks a little flat. Can we maybe give it some more Welcome oomph? Welcome to the dark side. Smile. Building something very quickly. All right, could use a little bit more oomph. It's very flat up top. Yeah, yeah, I know. Fucking master architect over here, apparently. <laughs> All right, I'm just trying to give some some solid criticism, you know? Yeah, 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 definitely. We all support one another in the Navy. Oh, dear. Yes, exactly. Uh, Miss Pauly, your building is looking wonderful. On In contrast... Uh, oh, fuck look, you. Thank look, you. Yeah, it looks so good. I love how the top of the building isn't flat. I'm so glad you noticed, Sight. I'm so glad I've returned. <laughs> um, Captain. Yes? Um, did she happen to use the, the, the swing technique? Oh, we're back to that. I don't think no, that was a technique that we didn't do. Not. You know? Oh, well, there you go. Well, I see where you got it from. Mm -hmm. At least it isn't something with brain damage. Oh. Yeah. The brain damage? Funny that, actually. Have you ever heard the story of how I got my brain damage? No, do tell, sir. You see, there was these two beautiful women with wooden clubs, and they beat me over the head until I got the brain damage. What a coward. <laughs> Cadets, sailors, for those of you who do not know who I am, once again, my name is Captain Richard Flemington of His Majesty's Royal Navy, head of the Naval Outreach Department, in diplomat to His Majesty Humple Dinkle Ferbert the Seventh, Esquire, and third in line to the Molten Chocolate Lava Fountain Throne. Yes. The throne that you're picturing is a chocolate fountain made of molten chocolate, and yes, he has to sit on it, despite the burns. Very good, Captain. Pleasure to see you again, sir. I'm a good noodle. You're, you're what? I am a good noodle. You're I not... The expression. You're not that skinny. Are you calling me fat masters, mate? Wait, <laughs> but the noodles oh, are skinny! How could you bonus... Bonus <laughs> me? How could you? But the, the noodles are very I skinny! My self-esteem. It's like... It's like this skinny. You're I not this skinny. This. <sighs> Devastated. It's got to be past ten thirty. Okay, it's got to be past ten thirty. Ten thirty to eleven. Uh, yeah, oh, yeah. You, know what, you know what I say to that? That's brunch. Sacre bleu. Yeah. That you mean sacre bleu? Sacre bleu. Sacre bleu. Is that not what you said? All right, go kills our translator. Go kills our translator from now on. Nice. Yeah, go kills the translator. Oh, that's perfect. Not going to be bad at all. My God. Oh my God. Yeah, suck his dick. Why does everyone Yes, Captain. Where is he? I need to follow the captain's orders. No, no, God. You know she's gonna. Seaweed, but a seagull, the fun toast frog. Yeah, it's excellent. <gasps> just no <laughs> idea what I said. No, that's all right. You don't need to know what you say. Just say it with confidence. Take it from me. I'm a 35-year-old captain. Not many people reach captaincy at 35 years old. You're 35? No, but you see what I did there? Oh, my God. That was genius. You said it with such confidence. Yes. Now go out I'm there. I'm six foot two. Are you? Yeah. There you are. It's that simple. Oh my god. Some might so call it lying. 
I just call it embellishing the truth. Oh, it's Italian. Italian? Oh, yes, it looks yes. Italian. Yes, it's very fancy. Mm, yes, très cher. And they say, yeah, they put in this really fancy low brow part right above my eyes. And then they gave it an aerodynamic feel. So that way when I'm running, I get even speedier and I feel like I'm taking off. I can barely feel the ground underneath my feet. They're like wings. Yes, I love the fact that they've added huh? a sort of hat unibrow for you, which makes you look a bit simpler. Not in a bad way, though. <laughs> in what kind of way, then? <laughs> you know, like a bit more of the common folk, like. Like? Like, it looks like you what? certainly know how to pedal, you know, sticks of butter. Pedal sticks of butter? Yes. Eat you... it all the way down. You're Danish? Are well, they the Danish? I'm not, but we are the Danes, yes. You are the Danish? Yes. I am Utrid. Barrel! Barrel! <laughs> oh, ba Barrel! <laughs> they, um, are, they, are, they, are they Swedish? I'm guessing they're Swedish. Oh, God. Quickly! Swedish. Look at them go. Uh, arm the cannons! We're getting out no. of here! Oh, shit! They're shooting! Get your gun out! Okay. Jesus okay. Christ! That was so close! Oh, come on, Witten, come on, we gotta go. Let's go. Ooh. Is she the one who calls you daddy? Shit. Can I call you, can I call you daddy? Please don't. <laughs> can I call you daddy, considering that you wanted to adopt me? Yes. Okay, Daddy. That's not fair. What? You've already been adopted by someone, I'm sure. No, I'm much too old for that. No one wants me. What are you talking about? Look at all those lonely mothers. Oh, yes. They're good for conversation and a good, you know... Bangers and Nash. I mean, Captain, you're my best friend. Yes. I personally cannot wait until Jolene gets so old that all of her teeth fall out. <laughs> we came from the Navy port. We were uh, checking about governorship and everything. Uh, we're oh, heading back to C6, uh, Alaya. Oh, is that where your uh, residence is? Uh, yes, well, we, we have a privateer dock that we're setting up in there. Pyro, oh, you're the worst. Hell. All right, fantastic. Pyro, you were well, the uh, worst. We won't keep you really any longer. We're just Get in here real close. No, no, I can hear no, this. No, no, I can hear no, this. What? Right. What no, are you doing? Right. No, I have to tell him a secret. All right. All right. <sighs> Go ahead. I'm listening. I don't want you to listen. I'm listening. Yes. Listen. Okay. There was a hat. And, uh -huh. and that was it. It was just a hat. It was just a hat. It was just no, a it wasn't hat. just a hat. It was just okay, a hat. so take Wait. the top hat that you're wearing right now and put two no, no, hats no, no, on top no, no, of that and then a hat in the Don't, 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 don't. There's just a hat that goes on top of it. And the people are like, wow, that's a really nice hat. Think of all your hats combined. Stop! <laughs> <laughs> he still hasn't said that's in order. So think of all your that's hats combined. <laughs> all right, I can't speak anymore. I'm sorry, Captain Clemmington. I'm so confused at what's going on. You know, you may you're maybe a little more thick than Miss Mouse is all. Are you going to take that insult, Miss Mouse? No. I don't. Are what? you saying that I'm not thick? Well, answer the woman. <laughs> That was, uh, I, Secretary I Pure Hammer. Say that I'm thick with one C? No, Miss Mouse, you are, you are thick with three Cs. It just so happens, as is the case amongst many humans of different varieties, that Secretary Pure Hammer is thick with five Cs. Out of the way, Miss Mouse, I believe he's mine. Jeez. <laughs> yeah. 
Uh, you haven't seen me crawl before, have you? Perfectly normal. Like I ate a baby. If you've noticed, my knees aren't even touching the ground. Oh, they're not. Yes, this is all calf string. It's like calves and elbows, and that's it. Yes. Wow. Very good core strength, sir. Yes, thank you. One's gut must be strong in order to do this sort of stuff. Oh, yes, absolutely. Oh, I see around this thing. Barkley. We are slapping Barkley. Shit. Because he says that he is not good at decorating, but if you look at our lounge area, He's decorated everything our rug in here. situation, he is fan fucking tastic. Pigeonhold. It's your job now. Jesus, oh, fucking Jesus Christ. Christ, that's not a slap. She will smack oh, you oh, hard, oh my way. god. Oh yeah. my god. It's yep. very nice. Now accept the compliment. <laughs> accept it. Yeah, no, I'm staying just, out of this it, one. It's, it's out. better if you just if you just lay back and accept what's coming to you, Barkley. I'm much more used to the violence, though. Barkley. There's there's no way out. She's faster than you, and you this know it. This place is beautiful. I would happily get naked and rub myself all over that carpet. That's how much I like it. Gentlemen, could you leave, please? First, I thought, oh no, it's just a misunderstanding. It's probably you know. Blown out of proportion. Now, there's a whole fucking operation that happened. Some secret mission. They just kidnapped two people. They literally just kidnapped two people. And now when they're... And now when their crew is here like, hey, what happened? Two of our crewmates were just kidnapped, and Flemington's like, Oh no, the Navy wouldn't do that. I'm sure this is all a misunderstanding. Let's get down to the bottom of the- And it turns out that it's fucking true! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> no wonder they're so freaked out. This actually happened to them. <laughs> 